It's the National Football League on EA Sports. And if it's in the game, it's in the game. It's the Giants and the Silver and Black. And it's coming up next on Madden Football. In a city of spectacle and grandeur, the biggest show in town right now is right here, Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas. Thanks for joining us, everyone. With my partner, Brock Heward, I'm Kate Scott. And like so many matchups in the NFL, Brock, our focus goes right to the quarterbacks in this one. Oh. Daniel Carlson ready to get us started. And we're off and running in Las Vegas. Starting from the five. He stopped on the return at the 27. So their offense out now to get this game started. It's first and 10. Throwing on their first play. It's intercepted on the first play of the game. Robert Spillane has it. And the Raiders take possession down inside the 30 after the interception. The Raiders take over first and 10 at the 28 yard line. First and 10, Minshew. Down he goes, the Giants got to him. And the big play drives them backwards. Second down coming up. Brings up second and 17. The now first run of the game is Amir White. He's across the 20, still going. And he's finally taken down at the seven yard line. They'll break the huddle and come up on first and goal. He was down by Jason first and goal at the seven yard line. Again, this is White. And he gets to the end zone, touchdown. The Raiders parlay the interception into points. For the offense, you gotta love it, Brock. Points to begin the game as he runs it in for an opening drive touchdown. And you've got one very happy running back right over there on the sideline right now. These backs, they do feel the pressure to find the end zone every single week. It's not easy to do. But to do it this early and get out of the way, big time. Carlson all set now for the kickoff. His return starts at the five. He's got a lane up past the 30. And he gets across the 30 before he's brought down. They've got first down from the 31. Trying to shake off the interception. He's looking to throw. Taking a deep shot there on first down. Okay, no luck connecting. It's incomplete. So after the incompletion, here comes the second down call. They'll run it with Devin Singletary. And he's tackled for a short game. Only two yards on the play, and it brings up third and eight. I think one thing you learn, Kate, when you transition from college to the NFL, not every run is going to be a big play. Some of them, well, they're just destined to end in a minimal gain, and some of them will set up that critical play action for later. That's caught for the first. And he'll be brought down a step or two shy of midfield. They're going to mark him at the 48. Still on the move, coming to the line for first and 10. Throwing here, Jones. They left him wide open. It's complete. And they catch up to him, but not until he's got a huge gain and a first down. A gain of 22 yards. First down, Giants. Here's Singletary on the toss. And he's able to take this one down to the 25. Give him five on that carry, bringing up second and five. From the shotgun, it's Jones. Reeled in at the seven. And they finally bring him down, but that is a big gain and a new set of downs. So before they... The 
second quarter about to get underway and an opportunity to score here for the Giants. Here's Singletary. And he's going to take this across. Touchdown, New York. The Giants start to fight back with their first points of this game. Devin Singletary with the touchdown. That one splits the uprights. And we're all knotted up. The Giants ready to kick this one away, and off we go once more. That's going to be taken in at the 8. This return makes it up to the 25. Well, we've already seen some nice plays here, and we're going to see plenty more before this game ends. But you might be thinking, with plays like that, my guy's ratings should be better. Well, you're not alone. You got a chance to let the Madden ratings hotline caught him deep behind the line. Oh, the ball is out! And this is going to stay with the offense as he makes the recovery. Let's see what they dial up on a second and very long. Out of the gun, Madison. And he won't salvage that. It's a loss on the play. Defense with an excellent opportunity and a stop here on third down. Throwing here, Minshew. And the pressure gets home. He doesn't throw it in time. That's a safety. How about the big fella blasting through the middle, disrupting everything this offense was trying to do. Oh, <laughs> baby. You love when big men make plays, huh? I, love <laughs> like it. I think you get more animated and excited. <laughs> like I do, I'm not gonna lie. Work, huh? <laughs> Yeah, they're doing their work. They're doing their job. So often they don't get all the headlines. They do so much of the dirty work. Not that time. He gets his headlines. He gets in the stat sheet. Two big points for his defense. Quick slant caught by Neighbors. And they'll take him down at the 43-yard line. Offense in the hurry up here. Jones on first down. He beams one deep right side. And they can't connect on the deep look. Still a couple of snaps to play with, though, here. We've got second down. Gives a Singletary from the gun. Past midfield to the 45. And he's down to the 42-yard line. The end result there, 15 yards and a first. So it's the two-minute warning here from Allegiant. The Giants. Looking for a bigger lead before the break. They'll head up first and 10 from the 42. Working from the gun, here's Jones. Well, the pressure nearly got to him, but still a good play defensively as that one falls incomplete. Couldn't connect on first, it's second down. Operating from the gun, it's Jones. He finds Johnson. And he gets down to the 24 before he stopped. The Giants using their first time out. They'll have two left to work with before halftime. All right, I'll set up now. First and 10. Pressure comes, Jones. And he will score. Touchdown, New York. The Giants grow their lead just before halftime. All right, partner, what do you think? Was that a design read, or did he just see space and he was reacting more on the old quarterback instinct there? Yes. <laughs> I think yes on both of them, and that play happens so fast that it really is instincts on both sides. You thought they were going to throw it, didn't you, Kate? <laughs> Could you tell? I did. I thought for a moment they might have been setting up to throw, but they stick to the ground. They're running in for two. Yeah, I think everybody in the building, because there's all these pretty pass plays, all these creative <laughs> designs, but don't ever get away from the simplest form of football, and that's running it right down your opponent's throat. The Vegas offense getting set for another drive now. And their last drive reached the wrong end zone and equal two points, so trying for the other end zone and six on this possession. He's on the move. And he's going to bring it up to the 40-yard line before he stopped. And now the Raiders call for the first of their timeouts. And they can take a moment to try to build more momentum after getting the first. Throwing on first is Minshew. He'll get this one to Madison. 
And the defense gets there to force a small loss. Minshew working from the gun. And he's got a decent game before being brought down. Raiders moving quickly, trying to get set as the clock continues to run. Buys time, rolling, and they get to him as he was trying to make something happen. Now the Raiders ready in for the punt, and they'll turn to former All-Pro A.J. Cole for the kick. Timeout taken by the defense, they're second. Now on fourth down, A.J. Cole headed out to handle the punt. And they bring him down to put a stop to that return. This drive starts with barely any time left. 13 seconds in the half. All right, keeping it simple. They're just going to call a give right up the middle. And this one doesn't go far. Give him a few yards on that run. It's second and seven. And they'll take a knee. We're through two here. I suppose not everyone's the biggest fan of halftime. Okay, we'll skip over the break and get right back to the field. The Giants ready to kick this one away, and off we go once more. Return coming from the six. And this drive will start inside the 25. Out comes Las Vegas on offense. And this game might be going better if he could have some more time just to work back there. This pass rush has been all over them. Really keeps taking this offense out of any grooves that they've managed to get into. You know, Kay, I like to say in life there's energy givers and there's energy vampires. And the Giants are too much. They take him down. And the big play drives them backwards. Second down coming up. It's second and 21. Another try following the sack. Then he's caught downfield on the right side. And they catch up to him, but not until he's got a huge gain and a first down. Right, trying this straight ahead. And they'll surrender just a lone yard. That brings up second down. He was brought down by Jason Pinnock. One yard gain brings up second and nine. Play action. It's Minshew. Bails out of the pocket quick. He's running with it. And this one does not go far. Let's see what they draw up on this third and seven. A gain of two brings up third and seven. Makes the handoff. Now Minshew. Caught him deep behind the line. Oh, the ball is out. And it's picked out by the Giants. And this ends as a scoop and score. We've got ourselves a touchdown. I think they would have happily just taken the turnover, Brock. But how about the wherewithal of the defender to take it back for the score? Yeah, that is a scoop and score in the definition of a splash play defensively. You don't just rip possession away from the offense. Kind of rip their heart out, too. You rip possession, you turn it into points, and now that beleaguered offense is going to have to get right back on the field. Still reeling a little after fumbling that away, but they're going to get it right back with this kickoff. Here's a return from the seven. And he's brought down just inside the 25 on the return. They'll get this drive started. First and 10. The Raiders have their offense back out there. They're running out of time to get this game into a more manageable spot, Brock. We've got a three-score deficit, and we're in quarter number three. They'll come to the line here, second and nine. A gain of a yard brings up second and nine. They go play action here. Down he goes. The Giants got to him. And that pushes him back. Third down coming up. A five-yard loss brings up third down and 14. Out of the gun, Minshew. He puts some power on a deep one left. That's going to fall incomplete. Either way, he was breaking it up. Good thing on to the pick. So hits the ground, brings up fourth down. Las Vegas sends out the punt team. First punt win 45 yards. This looks considerably further. And they bring him down to put a stop to that return. 
Good starting field position for the Giants as they head up first and ten. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. Over the middle, caught. Complete pass. And they finally bring him down, but that is a big gain and a new set of downs. Here's first and ten from the 34. A give up the gut to Singletary. And without much room to work, he has a minimal gain on the final play of the third quarter. Eight yards to go. Let's see how they approach this second down. Here's Singletary again. Stiff arm success. It's a great extra effort to keep that run going for a nice game. Seven yards on the run. That sets up an easily attainable third and one. They go play fake with Jones. And it's incomplete, and that's going to bring up fourth down. Greg Joseph on for the field goal. This is a 42-yard look from the left hash. And that one is good. A little longer, but no problem at all. And that extends the lead to 20. Get another shot across the bow of a ship that's already sinking here, Kate. He could have made that field goal. Heck, he could have turned around and kicked it directly at his coach because it feels like they've got this one in hand. Starting from the five. And the return sets them up just beyond their own 20. Now the Raider offense headed back to the field. They were only on the field for three plays their prior series, Brock. Let's see what changes they make to take over here. Minshew on first down. And the Giants are too much. They take him down. Offense up to the line fast. After the sack, another pass on second down. And he finds the seam down the middle complete. A dose of the hurry up offense here. From the shotgun, Minshew. Down he goes. The Giants got to him. Working quickly here. Trying again, following the sack. He throws a bullet deep to the right side. He makes the catch. And he's able to get this down to the 36. It's a gain of 31 yards. That's good. First and 10, Minshew. And he's able to drive this to the 29 before the stop. And now the Raiders call for the first of their timeouts. Second and three now. From the 29. Oh no, he lost control of another one. And the fumble recovery is made. And they limit the damage on the return, but it is still a turnover. You know they like to say about sports, it's 90% mental. Well, right now with this runner, after three fumbles, it's 100% mental. you got to hang on to the football. It's in his head right now, and it just can't happen. The Giants using their first timeout. As they'll meet and decide what to do on this second down. They'll stick with Singletary. And he's tackled with the first down yardage. I don't know about you, Kate, but he sure made getting that first down look really easy. A lot easier than it's supposed to be for that defense. And I think they'll hear about it when they get to the sidelines. And he maneuvers through the middle for a gain of four. He'll expect more from himself on those type of plays, but there is nobody that's going to complain about that one. If you can do math, four plus four plus four equals a first down. Second down run by Singletary. And they bring him down quickly, but he does have it across the 40. Give him two on the run. That's going to set him up with third and four. Jones. He has the first over the middle. And they get this down to the 28. Timeout comes, and that's going to be the second for New York. They're now set for a first and ten.
They'll go right side with Singletary. Manages just a yard on first down. Now it's going to be second and nine. Now an inside give to Singletary. Give him about three yards, and now they're going to have third and five to figure out. On the shotgun, it's Jones. That's caught for the first. And he's going to be taken down near the eight-yard line. That one goes for 15, and now they're going to have first and goal. The outcome's decided here, but we got a timeout with two seconds on the clock so they can think it over before their final play. Looks like they want to squeeze every point they can out of this game. Field goal team is out there. This only a chip shot from the right hash. His kick is good at the end, but boy, Brock, we might see some words exchanged at midfield here as they add three to the win as time expires. So it's a win for the visiting Giants. And save for a few moments in that opening quarter, Brock, they pitched a shutout defensively that in the end was the impetus for the victory. They're going to be bummed not to have that goose egg on the board at the end of this one, no doubt, but a performance to be lauded nonetheless. So for Brock Heward, our incredible crew, everybody here at EA Sports, I'm Kate Scott signing off. We'll see you next time.